Yo, what is up, YouTube? It's your boy Smeekwell, also known as Smeekwell, but you can call me Smeekwell. And in today's video, we are having another full court shot contest. And this time, we got the two number two picks that we think are going to be drafted. Well, we know Markel Fultz is going to be going number one to the 76ers. And everybody thinks Lonzo Ball is going to be going second to the Lakers. We'll see how that ends up turning out. But we're facing them off in a full court shot contest. So first up here, we got Lonzo Ball on the board. And we're going to see how many attempts it takes him to actually hit a full court shot. And then we're going to switch over to Markel Fultz and see what he can do. And these are the ratings from the NCAA 2K17 roster. So they're realistic. Lonzo Ball is a 79 overall as well as Markel Fultz. No like 95 overalls or anything like that. But leave a comment down below who you think is going to win the competition. Do you think it's going to be Lonzo or do you think it's going to be Markel? And of course, smash that like button. Let's try to hit 500 likes for today's video. Okay, we're starting off with Lonzo Ball here, and we're going to go from the edge of the paint here at the back of the the court. We're not going to go from this right here because obviously it's going to hit the backboard like that. So we've got to move to the side. We're starting off with Lonzo here. Let's see how long it takes him to hit here. First shot for Lonzo, and it hits off the rim. That was so close. He almost banged it home on the first attempt. Shot number two, and again. Again, if he shot it an inch further, that would have gone in. Two shots down, and there. Okay, the third shot. That wasn't even close. Three shots for Alonzo. Can anybody hit it in under 10? That would be crazy. Okay, that's bad again. He started off good. There's four attempts down. And now he's just doing bad. They're not even close. There we go. No. Five attempts. This is attempt number six. Come on. That's in. Hits the top of the backboard, and we're on to attempt number seven. Hopefully, neither of them take too long. Lonzo, there's number. Is that number seven? Yeah. Here's number eight. Attempt number eight right here. Can he hit it? And he sinks it on the eighth attempt. That was actually super quick for Lonzo Ball right there. Eight attempts for Lonzo. That's gonna be super hard for Mar Markel to beat. But let's find out if he can do it. We're going to switch right over to him now. All right, we got Markel Fultz up here next. And let's see what he can do. See if he can beat eight attempts here. And we are going to start off with him. Attempt number one coming up. Can he hit it on the first attempt? At least he hit backboard on the first attempt. That's all that counts. So first attempt is no good. Here's attempt number two. And that wasn't even close at all. So we're going to move on to attempt three. And oh, that was so close. That was so close. He hit the front of the rim. Okay, attempt number four. Attempt number four. Okay, that was... Mm, he could have done a bit better. We're on to five. I think over in this spot is usually the best at hitting. Attempt number five. That's looking good. And he sinks it on the fifth attempt. Beating out... Lonzo ball ball that was actually crazy I did not think he was gonna hit it in less than eight attempts but there you go Markel Fultz ends up hitting the full court shot in five attempts to take the W here yet again getting drafted before Lonzo now he's hitting the full court shot before Lonzo um, maybe we'll do some more competitions between these two but if you did enjoy it smash that like button Let's see if your pick actually ended up being correct Anyways guys that is it for today's video if you do like the full court shot competitions or half court uh, Leave a comment down below if you do enjoy them because I can do a lot more of them Anyways guys this has been your boy Smickle and I will see you next time peace